He was one of the FBI's top 10 most wanted back in 2021. It's important to get a person such as this because the propensity for violence is great. The medical examiner says the inmate found dead is 49-year-old Octaviano Juarez Coro. Officials found him unresponsive around 6.30 a.m. He was the only person in his cell. The sheriff's office says he showed no obvious signs of injury or trauma. Juarez Coro was in custody for two counts of first-degree intentional homicide and three counts of attempted first-degree intentional homicide. Demanded four of the five victims get to their knees, but before they got to their knees, he systematically shot each of them in an execution-style manner. The fugitive was wanted for the execution-style shooting of five people at South Shore Park in 2006. Mr. Juarez Coro shot and killed two individuals and wounded multiple others, including his estranged wife who was pregnant with a child. Sixteen years later, Juarez Coro was arrested in Mexico in February 2022. In October, he was extradited back to Milwaukee and behind bars in the county jail. Very proud of the uh, partnership with the FBI working together in regards to bringing this particular individual into custody. Very proud of the community effort. Sunday, the sheriff's department says a medical emergency was declared and officials started life-saving measures until the fire department got there. It's still unclear how he died.